It's the hottest building in town and it's bringing a booming business for its new tenants. And while the atrium has only been open for a few weeks, as Mary Beth Burton shows us, even for established restaurateurs, the response has been overwhelming. Peter Zambri plates pasta and clams for a customer. I want three sandwiches here, please. And then immediately, he and the kitchen staff at Zambri's in the atrium building must move quickly to keep up with the lunch crowd. We're going through probably at least a pot and a half of tomato sauce like this uh, once a day. Zambri's opened in the atrium less than two weeks ago. It's probably quadrupled, if not more. I think, I think our business is probably ten times what it was at the old place. The new Zambri's with plenty of light and space is a far cry from the cramped quarters on Yates Street where they were for the past 11 years. We've had a really faithful following and our clientele, you know, they're not just our clients anymore, they're our friends and obviously they followed us here, but they're only a small percentage now uh, versus the new clients that we actually um, have seen come through the doors. BC Ferries is the anchor tenant at the atrium. We found Ferries top boss David Hahn patronizing Zambri's at lunch. They probably had the demand before and I think the atmosphere here just enhances that and I think that's why they moved into the building. So it's good for the building, it's good for the tenants and uh, it's good for Victoria. Pig is pulling in big business too. Like there's only so much we could do in our little location and we're quadrupling it every day. The size of the restaurant has also quadrupled to 1,500 square feet. Pig is going through 30 dozen buns a day at the new location, trying to keep up with the insatiable demand for its sweet and savory pulled pork. And while the businesses who are booming can certainly take credit for their own success, some of the success might also go to this beautiful building and its X Factor. It's just it's the hottest building in town, that's for sure. The architecture is an inspiration for Zambri. It has elements of the future and it has elements of the past all mixed into one. You know, it's a LEED certified building, it's cutting edge. You know, you see the building and it kind of looks unassuming and then you walk into the atrium and it's... You know, something like, like a Guggenheim almost, like the way it's set up. Art in the architecture and on the plate may explain why the seats are always filled. Pig is planning to add weekend brunch items and the culinary sty is expanding. Uh, my little location on View Street, I'm turning into that um, to pig dogs, so selling hot dogs, hopefully open next week. The atrium is also growing with more businesses, including a new cooking school to come in the weeks ahead. In Victoria, Mary Beth Burton, A News.